Hey, what's going on guys and girls? I'm Colleague Phoenix here and welcome to episode number 23 of my Red Dead Redemption 2 Let's Play series. So, your horse is lost. Fuck. No way. There's no way we're going to run all the way back, are we? So once your horse is lost, I guess you never get another one, do you? Oh, shit. You wanna fucking go, bitch? Have I got anything that's less? There we go. There we go. Thank you. American Red Fox, huh? I guess it's pointless to skin it, isn't it? Because I got nothing to carry it in except for my hands. Good fox pelt. Hmm. There's a campfire on. Anybody own a horse that they could lend me? Anybody? Fuck, man, you could have dropped me closer to fucking Saint Denis. I mean, uh, to Shady Bell, I mean, like, fucking hell. How much money do I have? I lost all the money, too? No, fuck off. You've got to be shitting me. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, man, stamina. Sorry. Oh my god, that is ridiculous. Fuck, dude. I don't believe it. I gotta get all the way back. Hello. Anybody got a horse over here? I can't ride a pig, unfortunately. Welcome to Lemoyne. Shithole capital of the world. God damn it. Um So if I go to this then, there'll be no horse there. Horse. Who shows up? It would probably be in St. Denise. I probably can't get it back. Have a look at the map quickly too, because this should be like wanted dead or alive, right? No. I mean, $75 bounty. No bounty in Lemoyne. Interesting, interesting. Got a long way to go, dude. It's gonna be a hike and a half. Fuck the fucking fox belt. We're gonna hoof it. If we could find a horse to quickly tame, that'd be sweet, but I guess not. There's gotta be a way to recover our horse, right? You would think. Maybe it will show back up at camp? I don't know. Anybody got a horse over here I could borrow just for the purposes of getting back to Shady Bell so I don't have to spend 500 years running there?
Guess not. Eating me. God damn it. I would walk 500 miles and I would walk 500 more just to get back to Shady Bell. Find out no one's there and no horse as well. Can I get eaten by fucking crocodiles? Horrible sounds out here. Oh, that's a tree. God damn it, dude. Imagine how good this game could potentially feel on PC. Can you just imagine it, though? A horse. Got to be a horse outside one of these shacks, right? Like, it's fucking insane. Does no one have a horse to ride around? Like, they just walk everywhere out here? This is just dumb. Should probably go to a short side so I don't get munched on by a croc. Is that the mansion? That's where we are, right? We're near fucking Dickhead's mansion. Looks like it. Any spot that I can see my horse on the map? No. Man, this sucks dick, dude. Go! I would really love to steal that horse. It's been eight minutes of running this episode. Eight minutes of running. Okay, apparently wading through water just uses stamina in general. We're getting ever so closer. We're getting there. Just to gotta have a little faith. Everybody, just have a little faith. We will get there in due time. And fuck this place, dude. I remember this place. We shot those guys who tried to hold us up here. Like four or five episodes ago. What's up, Fox? Is there a horse here?
Fuck, man. They could have dropped me, like, somewhere closer to the coast, and it would have made my run infinitely less time-consuming. Like, this would be one hell of a workout. That's for damn sure. Running in the rain, holding two rifles, a one shotgun and rifle and a pistol. Fucking soaking wet. Insanity. These are some nice train tracks, man. Real sturdy. So close, I can almost taste it. We are so close. It's Shady Bell, dude. Doesn't look like anybody's here, though. Which is just fucking awesome. Shit. Like shit was just thrown out. Hello? Oh man. It's like they left in a hurry. Oh yeah. Susan! Strauss, you here? They left in a hurry, alright. Inspect letter. Tacitus, I do so hope you enjoyed your vacation. Lucky you, leaving like that. And you always suggested you were too old for travel. I hope you and your cousins enjoyed yourselves. Me and your grandnieces have decided to take a trip of our own, as the place has become so dreary and godforsaken in your absence. We have gone to visit relatives. From my daddy's side, you are not yet acquainted with them, in Lacay, a small village just north of Saint Denis. It's buggy and muggy, but apparently neither is too bad at this time of year. Please come see us when you can. Yours sincerely, Caroline. Thanks, well, Sadie. Thank you. Darling niece Caroline. Well, we keep sending us back every day to search this place. There quite clearly isn't a gang of outlaws held up here. Someone is here. Look, those are fresh footprints. Looks like someone might be here right now. Sure, someone is here. There's always someone everywhere. Well, let's look around. Then. See if we can find something for Mr. Milton. Mr. Milton? I'd like to find a poison snake for him. That's enough, Mr. Johns. You take Mr. Bunter and search around back. Fuck. Let's head inside. Gentlemen, be careful. Thank you for the horse. Assholes. Ooh, man. Sadie is a smart lady. <laughs> Let's go. I like the way they did that though. They make it seem like it's, you know, a, a family gathering. Um, do I have anything for the horse? I have an apple. You like that boy? Yeah, sweet.
Anybody here? Just about. <laughs> Something sad. Come on, it's raining. <laughs> hey, everybody, look who's here. How y'all doing? <sighs> hey, old man, wake up. <laughs> hey, Arthur, they got John. Good to see you. Yeah, he got arrested. He ain't hung yet? Not yet. They moved him to Sisica. He's been working on a chain gang. <sighs> Howdy. <laughs> How the fuck is Micah here, this piece of shit? find each other what happened can can somebody give me a cup of coffee or something yeah. <laughs> mrs adler who saved us dutch after the robbery in saint denis she got us away from the camp before the pinkertons turned up then mrs adler and mr smith drove away the degenerates of her living here mrs adler we owe you yes yeah. <laughs> thank you it's been real hard dutch we We've been surviving, but only just. What we gonna do? Just Best need some money. There ain't no doubt about that. Trust me. I am gonna get us out of here. This ain't over. Ain't none of you folks interested in our adventures? Mm. Guess we're more <laughs> interested in escaping the hangmen on our tail? Cheerful nymph of the prairie, wasn't you, Abigail? Oh, sure. My fair heart jumps for joy when I set eyes on you, Micah. <laughs> we buried Hosea Dutch. Charles and I stole his body from the law one night and gave him a proper burial. It was real nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, here you is. Well, I asked everyone I could find, and eventually someone new said you fools were out here. Shit. Give me a drink or something. Get your own damn drink. In our absence, Mrs. Adler here has been looking after things. Now sit down. This is Agent Milton with the Pinkerton Detective Agency. Already? On behalf oh, of Cornwall, Kerosene, and Tar, the United States government... And the Commonwealth of West Elizabeth. Here we go. We are here to arrest you. Come out with your hands up. Give them to a count of five, then give them everything. Actually, let them have it. Everyone get down! Don't the phone you! This is real bad. Stay down, Ollie! Fuck. Oh, I am about as fast as the as the game will let me. Where are we going? This way. There's a trap door into the other house. We can try to flank them. Smart. <laughs> they appreciate you, genius. Oh, 
God, this feels so fucking epic. Go to the Maxim gun. Oh, hell yeah. This is amazing. You saved us, Arthur. Oh, man. Bill and Sadie. <coughs> you okay, son? Sure. Well, we ain't been back for more than a few days. What, what do we do, Dutch? Clearly, we need to leave. It'll take them some time to regroup. Mr. Pearson, Miss Grimshaw, start packing up. Javier, you and Bill, get out of here. Go scare off any scum still loitering about. We need a couple of days. Now, please, gentlemen. George, what next, Dutch? We just need some time. I just, I, I need some time. Now, we can't go east. Because then we'll be in the ocean, so we're going to have to go north, I guess. I just need somebody to buy me some goddamn time, one of you. You'll figure it out, boss. You always do. What are you going to do about John, Dutch? John? He's in jail. Well, we'll, we'll get him. Abigail, just not, not yet. There's talk of hanging him. It's not going to come to that. Dutch! Not now, Miss I. Not now. I'm begging you to. He's... They're gonna hang him and break my... The boys, Mark, <coughs> please, do something. Wait, wait, wait. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna go figure out how we rescue this bastard. Now? Yes, now. Give me a Doyle's Tavern on Million Avenue. Okay. Do I get to sleep at some point in this fucking game, dude? It never stops. Oh shit, we actually did. What a goddamn mess. Everything. Not sure what happens next. The whole thing has been hard on all of us. Most of all on Dutch, who seems half crazed by all we've gone through. Sally! Fuck you, yeah, my dude! Um... Alright, let's do it. Go try and rescue John. So, uh, I guess we're stuck in the chicken coop, huh? Got it. Figured it out. We did it. We did it, Reddit. Thank God. Alright. Fucking hell, dude. It never stops. Any chance to get missions with Sadie, I'm definitely going to do them, man. He's world class. She is world class.
Oh, didn't think we'd be back here again without getting shot in the face. So that's nice. Oh god. Oh shit. Is he coughing up blood? Oh fuck. Sound okay? Mister, you don't look so good. Let's get you to a doctor. Come on, it's not far. Just oh, down the street. Shit. Carried me, you asshole. Why are you having me walk? Now you head in there, friend. Go on. What's gonna happen? Can I help you? All right. I need a doctor. Oh, uh, just one second, sir. Come in, pal. Come in. It's Christ. I need some help. And so it seems. And that's Dr. Mister to you. You fucking kidding me, cunt? I was joking. I'm a friend. I don't mean nothing, but you got money? I mean, before I start treating you, because I got a family. Yeah, I understand. Here, let this. Uh, sure. Thank you. Now, what an asshole. What's wrong? I mean, what appear to be the symptoms? Well, I think you've heard them. I'm, I'm coughing. Uh, is there any blood? Sometimes. Uh -huh. Okay, now here. Breathe. Again. Yeah. Let me see your tongue. Say ah. Ah. What is it? It's not good news. Well, I guess that. You got tuberculosis. I'm really sorry for you, son. It's a hell of a thing. What do you mean? You're real sick. You. It's a progressive disease. And you'll be. Best thing is rest. Getting somewhere warm and dry and taking it easy. Now, is that possible? Sure, I can just take my winters in my country club in California. No, it's not possible. Well, like I said, I, I'm real sorry. Yeah, well. Now, oh, wait, wait. Uh, let me get you a little bit more energy today. Give me some cocaine. Jesus. That was very quick. Very bad. Change what's done. You can only move on. Hmm. You have it in you. 
I can tell. He didn't have a choice. He was good and he did good. Hmm. Alright, well, I guess we're just gonna hear random things in our head. I understand if you don't want to help me, but but I think of you often. So is this Mary that I'm hearing? Alrighty then. Apparently I'm high as fuck. Yeah. <coughs> Any problems coming in? Nah. Guess they know now we ain't in the city. Who, Mr. Milton's friends? Yeah, they've had patrols out ever since you boys disappeared. Well, at least you're alive. For now, yeah. What happened in um... Guama? Yeah. <coughs> Nothing nice. What happened to Dutch? Cause he seems. I don't know. Seems as what began happening in Blackwater began happening years ago, maybe. A slow decline, I guess. What do you mean? I ain't quite sure. What happened here? I started gathering people up as best I could after you boys left. And John, you know that part. I do. And Hosea? So that too. Hell, we got Lenny's body out as well. Bribed the morgue and buried them together. Follow me. They say good a good burial. Oh, shit. So, what's your plan here? Well, I figure before we do anything, we need to make sure John's even still at this prison. And how do we do that? We need to get up high enough to get a proper look at the place. But it's on an island, ain't it? Unless you're planning on learning how to fly. That's exactly what we're gonna do. I found us a hot air balloon. You ain't serious. Now, the pilot, or whatever you call him, he thinks we're just in it for a lesson. A bit of a tour. <laughs> He's quite the character. I think you'll like him. You know, I'm impressed. You really stepped things up, ain't you? Hey, we didn't know if you was even coming back. Whole thing hit folks real hard. You can see it. Heron's gone falling fully into the bottle. Strauss is a bag of nerves. Swanson, well, Swanson's actually gone and cleaned up his act. So I guess it ain't all gone to shit. I'm just happy you boys were able to find us. Javier said he got the letter I left at the post office. That was a good idea. Until the Pinkerton showed up. Oh, by the way, I've been hunting O'Driscoll boys. Killed two of the sons of bitches at a campsite last week. What? Yeah. Seems they've drifted down this way now. You're a busy woman, Sadie Adler. <sighs> she a beauty, ain't she? From here on the ground, yes. Oh, Mr. God. Bullard? Hmm. Mr. Bullard. Ah, Mrs. Adler. It's good to see you. Good to see you. Ah, uh, this is my friend I told you about, Mr. Morgan. Ah, yes, Arturo Bullard. At your service, sir. At your service. Arthur Morgan. Well, it's a nice, fresh day for flying, sir. A day like today, an Icarus would have made it across the sea. Ha, ha, ha. Have you ever flown before, sir? No. Oh, well, it's quite a thing. Quite a thing. Now, put these on and hop in. 
Well, ain't she coming? Ah, well, women can't fly, sir. Are you insane? They can't. Oh, no, sir. It does terrible damage to them, to their vapors. I thought everyone knew about that. Why, a delicate flower like Mrs. Adler? <laughs> Heavens above! Orbelo. Ah. Where'd you find this guy? I told you you two would get on. <clears throat> Are you sure about this? Certain, sir. Quite certain. Mrs., let us away. <clears throat> Wish us luck. I've only crashed twice. Now, uh. pull on that rope and hope for the best. Ah! Fantastic. Boys have fun. How did you get out of this? <laughs> okay, here goes nothing. Right, time to catch a few vapors of our own. It's a little overcast, but I'm expecting some good wind once we're high enough. We should still have some decent views over the river. Now, one hates to be coarse, but on the subject of ablutions, liquids over the side, solids, do your utmost to levy the situation until we land. Okay, Mr. Bullard. I had a client once who fell foul to... Fuck a that, man. Decidedly harrowing experience for all involved. Keep going, sir. We need to get up above the clouds. It really is stunning up there. You'll have seen nothing like it. I've seen nothing like this, and also shitting myself because we're in a giant wicker basket. Oh, it's giving me anxiety just watching this. God. Yes. Heavenly indeed. Quite remarkable, isn't it? Feels like we have a nice westerly wind, so keep her around this height. This particular vessel is state of the art, sir. Imported from Europe. You won't find more than a couple of these on this side of the pond. So long as it works. Sure, you shouldn't be doing this. Oh, not at all. A child could operate this with a little supervision. Besides, Mrs. Fuck Adler, this. you were very keen to learn the ropes. We have plenty of those. She did, did she? Of course she did. Yeah, this is actually giving me anxiety. <laughs> so bad. How perfect is this? My mother was a keen student of the Italian eight. My brother's called Baldassario, so you could say I got off lightly. Look, I I'm trying to concentrate here. That's a hell of a view, though. Holy shit. Is the prison. Better. Look, we can see for miles now. Did you breakfast in the city this morning, Mr. Morgan? Not exactly. Well, I have a boiled egg in my pocket here that you're very welcome to. I think I'm all right, thank you. Recalling the ablutions uh, discussion. Well, just say the word. Maybe ease off the throttle there, sir. Can so, do. If I may ask, what got you interested in the pursuit of aviation? I didn't exactly. Uh, Mrs. Adler thought she'd surprise me. Ah, a very nice woman. And no shrinking violet. Definitely not. I prefer slightly more feminine attire on a lady, but variety is the very spice of life, as they say. Or is it, though? Did you know they locked up the man who wrote that in a mental asylum? I did not, Mr. Bullard. See that building up ahead on the island? That's the infamous Sisica Penitentiary. Infamous, huh? Shouldn't fly too near to it, though, sir. Sorry, we're going in for a closer look. What do you mean? Mr. Morgan, please, this is most irregular. Well, you want a happy customer, don't you? 
Look, this isn't funny now. What on earth are you doing? The guards are bound to spot us. Calm down. They won't care if we stay high in effort. I'm just looking for a friend of mine. A friend? Poor bastard has a habit of being in the wrong place at the wrong time. I heard they got him working the fields in a chain gang. Dear God. Hmm. The wind. Well, this is most unusual. Relax, Mr. Bullard. Take over. Keep us well away. I'll do my best. This filly isn't the easiest to control, you know. That ain't John. Okay, ain't by the barn. I can't believe we're doing this. That's not him. It's him there. Go! Yeah, you're not wrong. Fuck for that. Uh, we're in the clear now, Mr. Bullard. Get up. Good Lord, my heart is pounding. <sighs> I must say, the specifics of this job are not described to me at all sufficiently. Well, it's done now. <laughs> <laughs> he shit himself. Absolutely. Ah, there's Annisberg. Sure. Shit himself. Good Lord. Is that, is that Mrs. Adler? Where? Being chased. Yes. Trying to get us near. Will there be more trouble, sir? I expect so. I'm starting to wrap this. We're here to save your ass. Fucking insane. He's in one of them fly machines shooting at us. Get him out of one of the fly machines. This is awesome. Excuse me. Got him that time. Holy shit, Sadie. Okay, I'll come down and get you on the other side. 
Fuck. I'm trying, Sadie. Come on! I gotcha! That wasn't so bad. Did you break your neck? I don't think so. Uh, maybe. <coughs> oh, damn it, look. There's more of them on the other side. They must have followed us. Get behind something. This ain't over yet. Oh my god, it never this fucking ends. We'll get them all, don't worry. What are you on the fucking payroll of the Pinkertons now? Sadie, you're fucking insane. You're fucking nuts. I only left you an hour ago. You can't stay out of trouble for one goddamn hour. You got that poor bastard killed for his troubles. I kind of liked him. They got Comb, the government. They got Comb O'Driscoll. They're gonna hang him in San Denis. Hang him? Okay. Mm -mm. He's already been tried twice for murder and found guilty. Sure, no doubt he'll escape again. No, he won't, because we're going to make sure of it. I... We have our own problems with the law, in case you ain't noticed. Dutch will want to see him swing. <coughs> sure, Dutch. He wouldn't even help us with Marston. And our situation is really messed up right now. You know how things is. Bastard's going to swing. I'm going to make sure of it. Closely followed by Marston. You saw him? Yes, in the fields. Okay. Then we go rescue him. <coughs> from a state penitentiary? <sighs> but from the fields? Yes. That we can manage. It's well guarded. Guarded, sure, but not behind bars. No, it's not behind bars. Good point. So, that's how we'll do it. Bust him from his work detail. I guess. It's best just the two of us go. <coughs> the two of us is all there is, anyhow. Good, because two is all we'll need. I'll get us a bunk, a little one, and we'll sneak in and get him out of there. Meet me at Copperhead right. Landing. Thank you, Arthur. Whatever you say, boss. I heard that. <laughs> Pretty much, boss. been telling us what to do for hours now. Huh. 
That bounty's still available. Um... What's the stranger mission up here? I don't know. Hmm. All right, we get some oregano. Ooh, got the calls restored. Good start. Oh, the horse is down here. Sweet. Come here. What? Fantastic. Alright, awesome. So, anyway guys and girls, that is going to be the end of this episode. But if you liked it, remember to leave a like. If you want to see more, hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to follow me on all my social media links down in the description below. Thank you all so much for watching, and I hope you all have a lovely day. Alright, poise.